presence of the great Hussein, the greatest find, perhaps, from Iran. The great Hussein joining an individual competition the likes of the one-man riot squad, Dick the Bulldog Brower. But in the meantime, it will be on the one side, Ted DiBiase, who will defend the North American heavyweight title against handsome Jimmy Valiant. And with that in mind, let's bring on Mr. DiBiase now to discuss your title defense in Philadelphia. I know it uh, is a, gives you a great deal of pleasure to appear at the Spectrum. Well, it certainly does, Vince. This will be my second appearance at the Spectrum. And uh, the first time I was here, the people accepted me very well. I got one victory under my belt, and I might add that victory was over yet another Valiant brother and Jerry Valiant, and so tonight I'm going to go out and try to defend the North American heavyweight title against Jimmy Valiant. Now, having already been in the ring with one, I've got a basic idea as to their, their style, but each man is an individual, so I'm going to have to cope with just a, a little bit different style of a wrestler than Jimmy Valiant, but I also, in the back of my mind, know that where there's one, there's two, and possibly three. I've got a victory over one, so I'm going to have to be looking out for the others. Thank you very much. Thank Ted you. DiBiase hoping to successfully defend his North American title tonight in Philadelphia. Let's bring on the Valiant Brothers, Jimmy, Johnny, Jerry. Of course, we said it will be Jimmy meeting Ted DiBiase, but it will also be Johnny Valiant and Jerry Valiant defending the tag team title against Steve Travis and Gorilla Monsoon. Well, I'd like to add that Ted DiBiase's belt to the captain's stable, and uh, as far as Monsoon and, uh, and uh, Travis. Travis, I'm not going to cut them short. I feel that they do have ability, and let's face it, Gorilla Monsoon is a great big super heavyweight. And uh, Travis being the rookie of the year, so you've got to give credit where credit's due. But I don't feel the men are, uh, with the word I've used quite so often, continuity, togetherness. This is a tag team combination. Therefore, we have a combined effort. We thank you for your time. And I thank you for your time. The Valiant Brothers, ladies and gentlemen, along with Captain Louis Albano, Jimmy meeting individual competition, of course, the tag team. Beat it, Teddy! Tag team title up for grabs, as we brought out earlier. At this moment, Let's bring on, if we may, the World Wrestling Federation champion. To my left, Bob Backlund. And the question is, is Bob Backlund ready for the title defense tonight in Philadelphia? Vince, I'm very, very ready for this tonight. You know, it's the most important night of my life. I take everything one at a time, Vince. And right now, right here, is the most, most important thing, and it's on my mind very strongly. Greg Valentine thinks that he deserves to be the World Wide Wrestling Federation title holder. Well, I think I do. The Haystacks Calhoun is here. Greg Valentine, I know you're here someplace, but we're going to find out just who is the better man and who deserves to become be the World Wide Wrestling Federation title holder tonight right here. Bob Backlund unquestionably ready, ready for the match tonight. Only one excited about it perhaps is me because indeed this is a tremendous match scheduled for the main event tonight. A match that will employ the services of not only Bob Backman doing his level best, but with Haystacks Calhoun in there, you can bet the fur will fly. With that in mind, let's bring on the number one contender, Greg Valentine, along with his manager, the Grand Wizard. I just thought of a new name for Backland. Opie. You remember Opie on the Andy <laughs> Griffith show? That's exactly what you remind me of. And can you imagine a guy like this with a face like him being a champion? Now, a champion my mind and the wizard's mind should look like me a man with profile a man with beautiful long long blonde locks blowing in the breeze a man that wears two thousand dollar garments to the ring a man that drives a big long car not a short little Volkswagen like Bobby Backlund runs around in the street with Backlund this is it baby this is curtains for you the disease Bobby Backlund the disease of professional wrestling is gonna be stopped it's gonna be cured with a figure four leg lock. Just like I cured Chief J. Strongbow. <laughs> Put him in an ambulance. Just like I cured Tony Gurria. Now I'm going to cure you, Backlund. I'm going to cure the world of the disease of Bobby Backlund. And then they're going to have a champion. Well, the man like me, Greg Valentine, all that gold, all that money, everything is going to be coming my way. All the beautiful women, all the beautiful cars, the big yachts, the big boats, the airplanes, all going to be mine because I'm going to be the world champion, Bob Backlund. And there's no stopping this time because of blood, because you got a hole in your head. No referee's going to stop it this time. Hey, Sack Calhoun, we'll let it go on forever. Greg Valentine hopes to become champion tonight at the Philadelphia Spectrum. <laughs> 